I stand in solidarity with the Paris workers who stormed BlackRock's headquarters in April 2023 to protest the pension reform that would raise the retirement age by two years. This reform is a prime example of how multinational corporations and powerful institutions like BlackRock not only wield control over global financial systems, but also manipulate political power to further their own interests at the expense of everyday citizens. The protesters targeted BlackRock because they believed the company played a significant role in shaping these pension reforms through its influence on political decision makers. By promoting a system that favors private pension funds, the reform would force workers to seek supplemental retirement income through private investments, thus benefiting corporations like BlackRock. The protesters saw this as a direct attack on their financial security and well-being, prompting them to take decisive action against the company's headquarters. These courageous workers recognized the power that organizations such as BlackRock and the World Economic Forum hold over not just the global financial systems, but also the political landscape, perpetuating wealth inequality and eroding democracy. By breaking into BlackRock's headquarters, the protesters sent a powerful message that they would no longer tolerate a system that benefits the elite few at the expense of the majority. We must stand with the Paris workers in their fight against unjust pension reforms and the growing influence of multinational corporations like BlackRock in both financial and political spheres. We demand increased transparency, accountability, and a more equitable distribution of power and resources in our global financial systems and political institutions. Together, we can create a world that truly serves the interests of all citizens, not just the privileged few who control the levers of power.